he is traveling on a different, a very dangerous path. And if he does not correct it and change some of these appointments, even we who are his hardcore supporters will not be able to stand with him. It's up to you. If you feel that you are comfortable now, things are going to be easy now. They tell you that you can do whatever you like. You can do what Buhari or worse than what Buhari did. It is one-sided appointment. So you two can do your one-sided appointment. You are not Buhari. Know that. You are not. Buhari had a cult followership. You do not have that sort of cult followership. If there are cult followers, we are your cult followers. Those people who are now around, benefiting, making appointments, taking decisions, they were afraid to stand by you. If they were not afraid to stand by you, they will not go and be contesting for House of Rep and so on. If they actually believe that you win the election. They wanted a bed in hand is worth more than a thousand bell in the bush. That was what they were saying. We stake everything and stood by you. Today you brought them so they laugh at us that taking. They were afraid to offend people. Today they are the masters. So where are the falakers? Where are the patatis? Where are the people who stake their life, who stake everything, 100%, we are not looking back. Have total confidence in you. Where are they? They've all been relegated to the background. Where are the Angbaris? They've all been relegated to the background. Where are the Jutabai that goes from one rally to another with crowds, without taking a dime from you? You don't even know them. A lot of us did what we did, and we have gone into the end. I heard they are distributing money for people who are support group. You've never given us a time for any support group matter. Nobody has given us. None of them has them. In fact, I we they contribute. When they say contribute, we contribute, and they know it. We did not take when you came to aid me, you did not ask me to contribute a dime. You did it feasibly like, and I'm doing it feasibly like. But as an Ijoh man, I am telling you, these your appointment are wrong. And as an Ijo man, I will point it out. Ijo people have not done anything against you. Do not make enemies of us. Because nobody has made enemy of Ijo people. And I've not regretted it. Like I said, I've done my own as a friend. You did for me, I've done for you. I've supported you to the last bit. you to the last stage. It's up to you. I'll never be opposed to you. Anytime that business comes, I'll be there as a friend. Because you stood with me. You stood by me. But I will not also fail in telling you the truth. No matter how difficult, how bitter it is, because when we tell you in the house, when we tell you true text, true chat, true phone, they will come. The people who are afraid to take on, give you 100% support, will come and tell you, oh, Asari, Asari will put you in trouble, oh, Asari is a loose cannon, oh, Asari cannot be under control, oh. why should anybody control me? You don't know me. There are my people, anyway. 
I am an amakri, don't know that somebody will control me. Who will be that woman? Then create way of control me. I they control anybody. Why should I not have them control me? The other is a loose cannon. He cannot be controlled by anybody. He cannot be, be careful of Asari. Oh, whether you are careful or you are not careful, oh, I will remain Asari. There is nothing that can change this thing that I am Asari. I am talking about Asari. Nothing can change it. So it's up to you. This appointment will not serve any purpose for you. Mark my word. After I make this, they're like, oh, okay. I did where I did. Mark my word. It won't serve you any purpose. But as a friend, I'll continue to pray for you. I will continue to pray for you. Myself, my children, my family, my malams continue to pray for you because I have told the whole world I have told the whole world that if you fail they should hold me responsible because I had 100% confidence in you 100% confidence in you from what I know you of and your track record But these things have not encouraged us at all. Especially for the job people and the Igbo people. Enough Igbo people supported you. I'm not bothered about sick people like Iwayan. I'm not bothered about them. Or when they say in the Tom Tom, I'm not bothered about them. We are saying the truth. We are saying that what is happening to the Igbos and the Jaws are not right. You cannot be making this sort of appointment. It is not right. And it will not be accepted. It is not right. It will not be accepted. And the consequences of it will not be good. I don't know Igbos, but the consequences of it among the Jaws would not be good for you. Mark this day we are celebrating. Mark it. What you are doing to the job people, the consequences of it will not be good for your government. And as in Joma, I cannot live in your land. My friendship with you is because I'm an Ijoma. If you treat the job people bad, you are also treating me bad. If you make me if you give me everything in this world and you take everything from me, job people, don't give me anything. I don't want. As you take from me, job people, take from me too. Don't even look my side. You can go and give to traitors. Those people from where they come from that are bribing, go and give them. I don't give a damn. Don't give me. Don't give me a government in Nigeria from time immemorial, from uh, the time of Belawati now, you now give your job people. There was no minister. There's no substantive minister in a government where job people, the government, the job people are feeding. The government the job people are keeping alive. Abba, who does that? If it's an oversight, correct it now. Because it will have consequences. Congratulations to all of us who stood in this moment. But we must also express our distinction. <laughs> Obi. Obi will never be president. This one is closed. Anytime you come, let God keep me alive. I'll make sure that Obi, you know they call me. Don't even bother. 
making go they do in, in drug business and then catch them go face the warrant. <laughs>